Welcome to Digital Answer Base YouTube channel. In this video today, we'll be covering the AI spreadsheet. So it's actually from a company called The Bricks. Uh, Bricks. You can find them on thebricks.com. So this actually AI tool helps you to, if you're not an expert on, um, not, if you don't really have a great knowledge of Excel, this actually helps you quite a bit. What you can do is you can actually communicate with the AI and to help you clean up your data to basically just have a normal conversation with the actual uh, data um, with the AI. So to help you get what you want out of it. Um, so we've already uploaded some basically data, um, practice data. But if you want to upload, you can press add new. And then what happens is you can add a grid or board um, or chat. So basically a brick is uh, this is a cell and then obviously the grid is uh, a whole page and then the chat is the conversation you're having so let's just have a chat let's just see what we can kind of clean up this data so just kind of put things out so if you are someone who doesn't really have much knowledge of um, Excel and you just need to get quickly get all the information out of who's for example anything uh, who's the top salesperson or create me a list of the top, uh, top five salespersons. So without, uh, you know, just what you do at that point is just um, uh, give me a list of the, the top five sales. Um, also, so what we would do is, is give me a list from highest to lowest highest the lowest salesperson so so what's doing now it's just literally gonna give me a uh, so basically look it's saying I will create a summary tab um, uh, aggregation like look I, I am personally speaking I am not a uh, Excel person but the fact that I can just literally get that straight away it just makes life so much easier so then what i can do is um so i can kind of let's create another uh brick so then i can just go back here i can scroll back and so then i can just literally take the data from um what i need so i could just literally um say okay the actual price the list price and the discount so i can then say um for example, I can just have a normal conversation with the AI. So, uh, so from the salespersons on the on the sales uh, summary on the salespersons no, persons, um, give me a breakdown on who has used the most discount so again 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 i don't have a clue so basically what the, the, what's going to happen is you can use that data for example to figure out who's used the most um the discount the most discount um okay that's fine accepted that's fine so now imagine yourself um let's say you want to mix uh, combine the sales person summary with the discount summary uh, like i'm just going to have that ask that question so can you please combine the sales person summary and the discount so one sec and discount summary amount summary that's uh, so a discount summary so yeah so the discount summary yeah now it's, it's a discount summary this is the discount summary yeah discount summary and create a graph that is easy to read Again, I'm just asking it because I'm not an expert, so why not let the AI do what it's got to do if it can able to create this? Look, 
okay this was done so accepted so what it has done is it has created some sort of a graph whether that graph is good enough uh, again that's for some for you to kind of look at um but then that, that's again for you to look at but the power is the fact that if you do not have a, a strong background in excel uh, now what you can do is literally you can just take the data um, and then you can just literally put things together uh, you can upload the data to to breaks and you can kind of say okay give me um the stores the countries or etc you can kind of mix things together and just come up with a very simple and fast way of kind of taking the data that you need and just stripping out what you need and then putting it together sometimes this can this can save you hours and hours of work <clears throat> so you can even say or oh, give me give me the top sales people the top sales sales uh people in so spell right it's people in the uk so so what's going to do now identify here so literally like i just don't even have to have a goal it's going to literally create a whole list of except so these are all the top sales people in the uk I so said now even what you can do is um it's this is even I, I I'm just playing around with this now um what is the difference in percentage in percentage between the cell between between the sales people in all in, in all the different countries. If we can do this, then wow. So look what it's doing right now. It's literally calculating the percentage difference. That's fine. Wow, so Look at this. Look what it's doing. It's literally giving me the, the countries, the salesperson, the actual price, the current price, and the actual percentage of sales. So it's literally doing all of that just by me communicating with um, <laughs> this AI tool. I have, as I said personally, I don't really, I'm not, Excel is not my strongest point. Um, but the fact that you can just do this, and the fact, the fact that you can do this without even um or well, stressing about it whereas before it was like you need to know all these um to, no, figures and all these formulas on how to do it now you can literally have this conversation with the ai and you can literally uh, you can kind of strip it out so you can again here you can just give me so here you can even go more so give me um the sales by region uh, region so region port um, put all the sales persons in each region from high um, from high from high to low, then compare each region. Uh, region again. I'm just putting a lot of things in our region. Compare each region. Compare each region. Put the top region. Put the highest. And then create a separate table. On this separate table, 
you don't even if you're spelling yourself don't even worry about that separate table table with each with breakdown of the top to the lowest. Once that is done, please create a visual graph. Let's see if it does this. So now what's going to be doing is look what I've literally just asked them to do something very bit challenging. So let's see if it does all of this. If it does, that would be amazing. So look, it's wow, look at this. So accept. So look what's done. So look what's done. It's literally, it's done exactly what we wanted. Oh, so it's literally done region by salesperson, um, the actual prices, and then what it also did, which region is the highest, and the prices, and then what it did is look at. It's created a uh, a table with the region, the highest region, uh, coming down a visual table by region. Amazing. Again, this is if if you're if you're not good with Excel, the fact that you can just have raw data there and describe exactly what you want, and for the AI to literally create you all of this if you have meetings you can literally take this into a meeting you can say well okay here there you go we've got all the region sales summary from all the regions with all the top people in there you got the actual basically the top region side that actually you know you've got a table with all the top regions and then you can literally have this in your uh, actual excel sheet or your presentation where you can see sales by region the, the other thing that you can do is you can literally ex, um, ex export it um to your uh you can share so you can click share so you can literally share it uh it just give it a, a link where you can literally um you know to other people but this is how you use this particular tool it's called the bricks you can find the um the bricks.com it's um, got a free version i did all of this in the free version um, but again, if you want uh, to pay for it, there's some prices. Just check them out yourself. It's phenomenal. Um, again, as I said, it's for people, especially for people. You can even use it if you're, um, you know, if you're quite good with Excel. It, it kind of helps even if you know, I have a very low understanding of Excel and I can just kind of just ask questions and give them a, a, a few prompts to um, get what I want out of it. But then. Look at this. This is what you can achieve with it. This is a bit of a small tutorial. I hope this helps. But, um, best of luck. Thank you so much for watching uh, this little tutorial. Uh, please subscribe um, to this channel for more um, videos. And thank you much for watching. And please like the video. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.